if this was video that didn't matter, then why is it getting so much attention and why has it gotten so much attention? I mean, early on, I was contacted by the head astronomer for New Zealand, um, astrophotographer, I think it was. I was contacted by a observatory in, geez, one of the Stan countries. Uh, I don't remember which, Kyrgyzstan, or I don't remember, and I think I'm mutilating that name, so I apologize. But, you know, these places called me to, to actually have, take issue with the fact that I had filmed the lunar wave and put it up and was saying out loud what I thought it meant. Really? Is that the case, Crow? Triple seven? This is Dazza the cameraman and today is Sunday the 12th of April 2015 and this is a response to Crow's latest video, Attacks Do Not Change Facts, uploaded on April 10, 2015. Uh, he makes some interesting claims in that video and uh, we can actually check out some of those claims as you're going to see in this video and let's see how honest Mr. Crow 777 is being in his claims. I mean early on I was contacted by the head astronomer for New Zealand, um, astrophotographer I think it was, I was contacted by a observatory in Geez, one of the Stan countries, uh, I don't remember which, Kyrgyzstan, or I don't remember, and I think I'm mutilating that name, so I apologize. But, you know, these places called me to, to actually have, take issue with the fact that I had filmed the lunar wave and put it up and was saying out loud what I thought it meant. I am a member of the Aotearoa Astrophotography page on Facebook. Aotearoa Astrophotography is the largest astrophotography Facebook page in New Zealand. Aotearoa is the native Maori name for New Zealand. As you can see I posted the following question on the Aotearoa astrophotography page. At 10.50 in his video Crow claims that he was contacted by the quote head astrophotographer in New Zealand end quote. Does anyone know anything about this please? As you can see from these screenshots, Dr John Drummond confirmed that he was indeed the astrophotographer who contacted Pro 777 on his YouTube channel. John Drummond has given me his permission to quote him here. As you can see from these screenshots from Crow 777's YouTube channel, the exchange between John Drummond and Crow 777 had nothing at all to do with the lunar wave, but was a discussion about Comet Ison and the planet Mars. This is clear evidence again that Crow 777 has an unfortunate habit of twisting the truth and embellishing the facts. And here is a screenshot from John Drummond's own YouTube channel showing his activity on Crow's channel. I mean, early on, I was contacted by the head astronomer for New Zealand, um, astrophotographer I think it was, I was contacted by a observatory in, geez, one of the Stan countries, uh, I don't remember which, Kyrgyzstan, or I don't remember and I think I'm mutilating that name so I apologize. Yes, and you should apologize to Crow 777 because you have a nasty habit of misrepresenting the facts, twisting the truth and embellishing stories to suit yourself. This is going to be one of several videos, Crow 777, calling you to account for your lies, because as you said, facts are not debunkable. I will post links to these posts on Facebook and YouTube in the description area so that you can check them out. Thank you for watching.